Alright, check me out. I do tell me, I do tell me the other day, Louis, man, you talk a lot of bullshit. I hear what you be saying, blah, blah, blah. Acting like you hard or something. I'm not acting like I'm hard or nothing, dog. I'm just, I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? This is just what it is. I'm talking about how life is, what I see. I mean, hold, hold up, hold up. I'll show you what the fuck I'm talking about real quick. Let me show you what the fuck I'm talking about. Shit like this. Let's check it out. Like when I say, when I say I'm on probation for extortion right now as we talk. This is what the fuck I'm talking about. Look. That's the motherfucking court papers. You see that shit? Extortion, grand theft, burglary. Louis Thomas Pavone. That's me. You feel me? What the fuck is this one? Look. See, this, one, this, is, all, this is all last year. 2011. Fucking DUI. Fucking violation of probation for being having a DUI. And failure to appear. FTA. Violation of probation here. Fuck them. That's why. I mean, shit. damn my PO. You gotta come find me. Word to plies. Oh, y'all wanna see some funny shit? Since I got this shit out. All right, check this out. This shit's funny, than a motherfucker. Now I'm gonna tell you the story. Go with it. Hold on. Peep it. Look. See, I got this in Arizona. That's Kimberly Ellsworth, Louis T. Pabone. That's me, A.K.A. Lou Motherfucking Laden. Former employee. Quit place of business. Listen, I'm going to read this to you real quick. It says, quit place of business and conspired with a number of employees to steal company property. Also have witnesses to put company in hardship. Stated he would set fire to my building. Check this out. This bitch's business was going in the tank. I hadn't got my check yet. So the exact phrase out of my mouth was, this bitch better give me my money. I'm going to burn this motherfucker down. I didn't say I was going to set fire. Well, yeah, I said I was going to set fire to him. But pay me my motherfucking money. Fuck. All right, second thing. Found out that Louis, Louis, as well as Thomas McHugh and Leslie G. Ellis were calling my clients using my company name from another location. Now that's just Bullshit. I don't know what the fuck that bitch is talking about. Heard through witnesses that spoke with Louis Pabone and said that he and Thomas McHugh, what's up Uncle Tyler, were hiring a man to come and beat me up and rape me. Listen, I'm going to tell you why that was bullshit. Really, it, I wouldn't spend the money to, to uh, hire somebody to go whoop her ass. I'd, I'd be like, Uncle Tommy, uh, let me get, you know, I'll get $40, and I'll pay this dude to go whoop this bitch's ass, and he'll be like, alright, and he'll give me the $40 to go pay this other dude, and I'll just go whoop the bitch's ass and keep the $40. Let's kill two birds, that's a win-win, you dig? Now, have witnesses that state and will testify that Louis Pabone has fled from the state of Florida from parole or probation. So not only is this bitch a liar, she is snitched too. You know what I'm saying? Look, admitted fled from Florida parole or probation. So, uh, I'm not just talking shit. I'm just, I'm just telling you what it is. But that's some funny shit too, you know what I'm saying? One day we'll really get into it. I'll tell you why the whole extortion thing came up. That was some fucked up shit. Uh, and, uh, man, fuck. Just, now you know, you know what I'm saying? It's early as fuck in the morning. I'm about to be out. Holla at your boy. YT for life, motherfucker.